Welcome back to channel everyone. In this video, I'm going to talk about how you can save your MS form attachment to SharePoint list using Power Automate. I'm in my MS form right now. So first thing which I need to create is a form. I'll click on this new form here and I'll name it Upload Data. And I'm going to create a text entry here that is my title and the second thing which I need to create is this file upload and there's a small notification which says that all of your content that means attachment will be saved to OneDrive for business click on OK and the name of this one is upload file you can select uh, the number limit for the attachment I'm going to select three that means maximum three attachment I can save for this particular one and the size limit for each single file will be 100 MB so I'm good to go I can see this in my preview that it's look good and now this data need to be submitted in a SharePoint list so which I've created here with the name of home attachment so this is the simple list with the default column title and the list has the default attachment field and third thing that's I need to do is I need to create a flow for that which actually save the attachment to this particular list so let's just talk about how we can do this I'll click on create instant flow the trigger point which I need is form skip this one Microsoft form and the trigger point will be when a new response is submitted click on this one pick your form ID is your form name I will be upload data our form name is upload data so I've just selected upload data and the next step which I'm going to do is just type form here get response detail form ID will be again your form name that means your upload data and the response ID will be your list of response notifications response ID so once that is done the next step which I need to create is I need to create item in SharePoint list SharePoint create item select my site address which is this one and where we want to save the data is our basically this form attachment list so I'll select my list name which is form attachment and right now there is a title column and which I need to map with this my get response detail title so we are good to go so till now our form data will be saved to my this particular form attachment list without any attachment so let's just uh, do one entry here and just type test one and upload a file click on submit and we'll see that the response will be created here you can see that the test one is created here in this list and if I click on this there is no attachment for this particular one as we have submitted an attachment but the attachment is not saved in list so for that one the next step which I need to do is go to next step 
click on pass json content will be my attachment column name which is upload file yes it will be upload file and the schema will be I need to create a schema for that so I've already created a schema I'll share this one with you guys on my comment section you can copy this schema and paste it here as it is and now the next step which I need to perform is uh, get file content using path so I'll just go in my drive for business here one drive for business and get file content get file content using path and uh, the path will be so basically uh, what this path will be when I create this particular upload entry here a automatic folder is created here in my uh, one drive for business with the name of upload data so I need to just copy this particular path which I've already done it here by using app slash microsoft form slash upload data slash question you can see that's this one basically and i'll just paste this one here in my file path once we are in these uh, question folder after that you can see that the attachment it's saved in the named column here so i'm going to select name here it will just automatically convert this to apply each one and the next step which I need to perform is add attachment which I will SharePoint add attachment select the site address where we have to submit the attachment and the list name will be my form attachment which is this one id will be create item id for the list file name would be uh, you can so file name which i'm going to select is the name for the file and and the file content will be my file content which we are fetching from this one drive i'm sorry on the file content this will be my file content and we are good to go i will save my flow now and go in my ms form here go in preview and just type test entry one upload file I can upload multiple file as you can see once that is there click on submit a flow will be started in background once the data is submitted it is submitted now I'll go in my flow and we'll check the status the running it is successful now so that means the attachment should be there there is our test entry one and if I click on this one we'll see that we have all three attachment we have just saved in my MS form here in fact click on each one of this it will be <coughs> open there for us so this is way how you can submit your ms form attachment to sharepoint list using power automate i hope this is helpful for you if you like this video don't forget to subscribe learn and tech thank you so much for watching